I'm just wearing two pairs of shorts because I accidentally... Uh, shit yourself? Not shit, but didn't wipe enough in the top. <laughs> the top. The top. <laughs> <laughs> so I put on a, a, second one, a second pair of shorts. Dude, my fucking roommate bought Scott's fucking toilet paper. One ply... Like we're in a fucking middle school. He's got a good job. It's ridiculous. This mo- you had it in your that. Nick that had it here for a while. Nick had I, it for way too long. You can't long. do that. Well, bro. Nick had using, it for way too long. I started using a water pick on my ass. Oh no! Nice. Like a yes. handheld bidet. <laughs> Nice. And then those are for your mouth. <laughs> I heard. <laughs> no, we, <laughs> this man, some dumb bitch, I got probably it. used it on her mouth without <laughs> knowing. I got, I got Just it. had Nick's asshole juices I all got over it. her teeth. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> I got it at MacWorld.com. All right. And I all pick right. it up and I put it in my ass. And I go, "This is the president speaking." <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you, you do re- a different voice uh, whenever you, it's in your ass. You've reached Barry Obama. Oh, oh God. Uh, this wish. is President Obama speaking. <laughs> uh, uh, hello? <laughs> uh, you've reached my personal cell phone number? <laughs> and <laughs> then I. T- yeah, hell yeah. And I'm just picking my ass. Dude. That's awesome. Uh, Mr. Vice President? Um, well, the nice thing is about uh, Mac Weldon. Me Mr. Uh, fucking sauna in the Oval Office. And we're so, going to have gay sex. And we're going we're gonna to gesture at each other and, and court each other like homosexuals do. <laughs> we're going to, you know, bat our eyes and fucking do a ritual. <laughs> um, and t- I do. I really have. Like, you can see that I tore a hole in this pocket. This mm-hmm. one's all fucked up. Mm-hmm. Or maybe mm-hmm. I'm... Maybe I maybe I put these on. Oh no, no. see that's, that's fucked up. And uh, I ripped uh, one of my shirts. I have not destroyed any pair of Mack Weldon stuff. It's awesome. All that's my other impressive. Clo- all my other clothes are destroyed. Yeah. And um, and people close to me don't speak to me anymore and stuff. And, <laughs> but the Mack Weldon loyalty <laughs> program becoming a level one member. <laughs> It's as easy as making a purchase <laughs> with an account. Because I, I need to get... Because I keep tearing all of my clothes. Mm-hmm. You know, when you're about to have passionate gay sex. No, nah, I keep getting... I'm, I've become you clumsy. your boyfriend, DeAndre. I keep... I, I just smash into shit now, and my clothes get stuck on things, and I'm always getting my, like, pockets. Getting your, your, your shorts caught in well, my uh, door revolving knobs, doors. Doorknobs <laughs> go into my pockets all the time, and then I get, like, ripped around, and I rip the pockets out of my shorts. I'm like, Kevin, I'm struggling lately. <laughs> um, <laughs> you're like, a, you're, you're just living like a, one of the three stooges. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> it's because, look, some of us have a, a will, as Schopenhauer would put it, a will to form. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I can only move in the direction of becoming more of a joke. Mm. More of an embarrassment. Schopenheimer? Who the fuck is I that? Don't know. I just <laughs> He's a guy. <laughs> He's definitely <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm just I'm letting it I'm kinda just I'm letting we're doing, it fly. Yeah, 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 let let, let, let it fucking go, bro. Let him cook. Let him do a little free this is a little free jazz. Do a little jazz. As Schopenheimer once said, <laughs> you can only move <laughs> towards <laughs> the direction of the f- ultimate yeah. Uh-huh. Being. Of the being, of the and getting. There is to get and there is to form, be gotten. The form the being, but then there's the form of getting. All we do together is go to lunch. Which is a great, nice thing. I, I hate doing shit. I love going to lunch. I like mm-hmm. doing stuff. I like, no. having, I like having my joke around friends that I see at work only. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then having my serious friends. Right, no joke. No, yeah, I hang out with a bunch of neurosurgeons. Yeah, yeah. scientists. And and a we lot have dinner. Of snobs. We, have, we have very quiet dinner parties. And I would say, uh, oh, Richard, um, my inquiry to you last week: uh, Did you get a chance to take a look at any of that research? And they're like, uh, you mean the email asking me if you could implant gay memories into someone's <laughs> brain <laughs> with a baguette? <laughs> <laughs> do baguettes cause gay thoughts? Mm-hmm. Do they? No, if there's no pro- reason. <laughs> there's Is no there research on that? That's interesting. I beg to differ. <laughs> I think it was a bag. I mean, I think theoretically a baguette could do that. I suppose in my estimation it I, could. Maybe the, there's just a lack of, it's as with everything, a lack of funding for the research, I would say. <laughs> no, I, I don't think no. it's a... I don't think there's any mechanism by which eating a baguette could make you 
gay for tw- yeah, twenty minutes or whatever. Shit. Whatever you said, <laughs> <laughs> twenty minutes a month. If yeah. you meet a baguette, you get to be gay. Uh, uh, Danielle, and it's not uh, your fault. And the email I sent you, yeah, the go gurt in your ass thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a medical we question. We cannot replace. We cannot sew your balls into your asshole yeah. and make it a fridge. No, I don't know don't. what an intercooler is. <laughs> and no. <laughs> mm. uh, I just uh, like it, the intellectual curiosity. Of, I'm I'm asking questions. I'm really. asking questions. I'm trying to be a intellectual As you know, provocateur. I, I subscribe to National Geographic magazine. <laughs> I am an intellectual, after all. <laughs> I voted for Bernie Sanders, and prior to that, I was uh, more of like an adult swim kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> and then after voting for Bernie Sanders, I realized I'm an intellectual, and I immediately subscribed to National Geographic magazine and started mm-hmm. asking questions such as, whose fault is it that I'm a fucking loser? Yeah. Is it because I eat baguettes is that I think gay uh, shit? Yeah, because obviously I'm a genius of some sort. <laughs> obviously yeah. I'm a straight genius. Mm-hmm. Well, all of these, these you know, esoteric concepts I can easily repeat. So it's more like, it's like a salon, you and your friends. Yeah. You guys are just thinking of like, you bring different like uh, high flutin things to a meeting and then you present them to one another. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that I know. Who do you have in the crew? Just a couple of neurosurgeons and then some bitch named Danielle. (laughs) Really? What's she like? What's her? She's hot. She has big tits. Shut up. One of these days, you might fuck her. 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 Once I get the other doctors to convince her I'm not gay (laughs) (laughs) through science, (laughs) and I get her to trust the science, (laughs) right? Mm -hmm. Then it's fucking over for that bitch. Over for that bitch's (laughs) pussy. Have any of the doctors (laughs) fucked Danielle? Be Danielle's pussy. (laughs) Boom. <laughs> she doesn't think I'm gay. It's done for her. She's got nothing. <laughs> no chance, bitch. That's the only thing keeping me at bay is you thinking I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> that little blockade is lifted. Yeah, yep. Yeah, that's the final domino to that. fall. And that's my movie dinner party hitting. <laughs> it will be on Peacock. <laughs> <laughs> be on Peacock 2 my streaming platform <laughs> my leftist streaming platform <laughs> Peacock.tv oh fuck dude also I don't want to call out you know any particular people but yesterday I posted a very sweet uh, video for my anniversary to my girlfriend and uh, a man called criminal at criminal retard told me I was gay. <laughs> so that really hurt my feel- my feelings. I also saw so, a, a, smooth, a smooth brain criminal. You been hit by <laughs> at you been struck by a smooth brain criminal. <laughs> Annie, are you okay? Can I get one of those pretzels, Auntie Annie? <laughs> <laughs> Are those the free samples? You know I like them. I love the free samples. <laughs> no one knows to tell me that I'm only allowed to take one because I don't know any better. But actually, I know better. It's a system that I've worked out. <laughs> I, in fact, a lot of people don't know that wheel power and Down syndrome is taking unlimited free samples. <laughs> no one will stop it. It's the perfect crime. <laughs> That's fair, dude. Go yeah. crazy at Costco, man. Yeah. See, I haven't lost my edge, dude. No. no I mean, I don't know it. if the lithium's is working yet, but no. You just got to find a new edge, dude. You got to get like into it, leather dude. jackets. Uh, look, I'm not. Uh, nothing's changed about me, guys. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. I'm on lithium, and then the Seroquel is just for when I start having psychotic thoughts. Uh-huh, and you need to touch the ground and to make I, sure you're alive. Right, exactly. <laughs> it's only when that happens and I can't stop screaming at the air conditioner. Yeah. That's when I need to take <laughs> the Seroquel. <laughs> and the lithium, okay, that's what they use in batteries for power tools. Uh-huh. That's right. Yeah, yeah this half is machine, half machine. What this dude. is happening right now is a step towards a synthesis That's right. between me and pure mm-hmm. numinal autism <laughs> yeah. as it exists in the unseen world. Hell yeah, dude.